Hello, I am Sam the Statman, coming at you with another video. Today we're going to be seeing who are the top five center fielders who are currently playing in the MLB. This is another video in my series where I see who are the top five players from each position who are currently playing in the MLB. And, um, yeah, so without further ado, let's get into it. Number five is Brett Gardner. In 2019, Brett Gardner batted 251, 325, 503 with a 117 OPS plus. He had 123 hits, 28 homers, and 4.1 war. In his career, he's a one-time all-star, has one gold glove, and has 42.3 war. Number four is Ronald Acuna, Acuna Jr. In 2019, he batted 280, 365, 518 with a 122 OPS plus. He had 175 hits, 41 homers, 37 stolen bases, which means he was just three stolen bases away from a 40-40 um, season, and he had 5.71. His career, he's won Rookie of the Year. He is a one-time All-Star, has won the Silver Slugger Award once, and has 9.9 war. He is a fantastic young, young player, one of the best young players in the game, and he um, he's going to be great for years to come. Number three is George Springer. In 2019, George Springer batted 292, 383, 591 for a 150 OPS plus. He had 140 hits, 39 homers, and 6.4 war. In his career, George Springer has won two Silver Slugger awards. Three all he's made to three All Star games and has 25.4 war. George Springer is a fantastic player. Number two is a guy who had a big, big, big breakout year in 2019. Cattell Marte. In 2019, Cattell Marte had 329, 389, 592 with a 149 OPS plus. He had 187 hits, 32 home runs, and had 7.2 war. In his career, he is a one-time All-Star and has 15.1 war. The reason I put him ahead of George Springer is just because of that incredible 2019 where he was like the second best center fielder in baseball. But he was second best because number one is Mike Trout. What would have happened if I didn't put Mike Trout at number one? There would be riots in the streets. People would get really, really, really mad at me. How could I not put my try at number one? I mean, I was actually originally planning to say, and number two, my try. No, just could, could tell Marte. But I realized, if I said that, right when I said number two, my Trout, a lot of people just ended the video, gave it a dislike, ended the video. Um, because, like, if you don't say number one is my Trout, that how how do you say that Mike Trout isn't the best center fielder in base in baseball today? And how do you say that he's not the best just player in all of baseball today? Mike Trout is a fantastic player. In twenty nineteen, Mike Trout batted two ninety one, four thirty eight, six forty five with a one eighty five OPS plus. He had one hundred thirty seven hits, forty five homers, stole eleven bases, and had eight point two WAR. He won the MVP that year. In his career, he's won a Rookie of the Year award is a three-time MVP, has made to eight All-Star Games, has won the All-Star Game MVP two times, has won seven Silver Slugger Awards, and has 72.8 war. There's just no way around it. Mike Trout is the greatest player of this entire generation. He's the greatest player in baseball. He's like pretty much a guaranteed first ballot Hall of Famer. And if he keeps up like if he keeps up this pace and he keeps up keeps doing what he has been doing for the since he um since his rookie year, um, he's going to be up there with names like Ty Cobb and Willie Mays. He's going, he's he's going to become. I'm pretty sure he's he's like going to become an all-time legend and one of the all-time greats. That is, and I mean, like he doesn't show really any signs of stopping. I mean, like he won the MVP last year, and he's been around for since like 2012. I and in 2019 he wins the MVP. He's just going to keep getting better, maybe. He's just going to keep being great. He's going to keep being the best player in baseball for years to come, and that is why I put Mike Trout at number one. That was the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.